Hi, thanks once again for joining us at Collector's Corner for our newest unboxing for comic books that are going to be coming out on Wednesday, May 27th. This uh, package is actually what we got in from uh, Diamond Comics, and uh, so it's going to be everything except our DC comics that have been released. This is kind of our late edition because due to the Memorial Day weekend, this didn't show up until tonight. And so we're trying to get this out for you guys to take a look at. And all these products will be live on our digital purchasing platform very shortly. Um, also, make sure you watch to the end of the video as we are going to have a, form, uh, uh, a format for you to be able to win a $10 gift card. Uh, and we're going to do that every single month. So we'll get that information at the end. But we've got a lot of books here, so let me just jump right in. The first thing is that Diamond has shipped the new previews magazine. This magazine is everything that is going to be coming out from Diamond uh, in two months from now. So normally they have one for each month, but this is a May-June uh, book that was combined. And uh, so it's got toys, it's got your comic books, it's got everything in it. We are going to have another format that we are going to be using very shortly, and I'll make a special announcement with that when we're ready, but uh, you can get this and be able to see everything that's coming up shortly. So let's just jump into this. We do have books from Image Comics. This is uh, 20XX, and uh, it is issue number four. Alienated by Boom Studios, number three. This is cover A. And if you haven't been reading their products, they've had some amazingly good stories, original stuff that's been coming out in addition to all their licensed properties. This is Alienated number three, cover B. Then the first new Marvel book since the COVID uh, sheltering at home is Avengers number 33, brand new story arc. And as you can see on the cover, they are going to be spotlighting Moon Knight. We do have a couple variant covers for this issue as well. And as I said, these will be live on our digital purchasing platform. And there are a lot of items that have been coming out as well that uh, we aren't stocking. So be sure you check out our listing of all upcoming items because if there is anything listed there that you do want, we can special order in it, it in for you. This is the IDW version of the uh, Avengers, Marvel Action. This is number 10, the last issue in the previous series, which is actually being published out of order. But uh, if you were enjoying that series, that would definitely be the great one to pick up. Blackwood. This is by Dark Horse, number three. Also by Dark Horse, Butcher of Paris. Another IDW book. For Marvel, Captain Marvel. That's issue number five. Dave Sim has been uh, publishing Cerebus still. And this is his tribute cover to Green Lantern, Green Arrow. Then we have some Aftershock comic books. This is a new number one, Dead Day. Then Disaster Inc. Exo Sisters, number six, cover A and B. This series sold really well for the first story arc. They're starting back up there. Farmhand, also by Image. This one has a really cool wraparound cover. Frankenstein Undone, number two. This is a mini-series uh, set in the world of Hellboy. Let's cover uh, B right here for the same issue. Now, Boom Studio has also been doing a bunch of variant covers recently. On this series, Kings of no King of Nowhere, this is issue number two. There are actually three covers that they're doing this time around. And one of their uh, slightly older properties got picked up for uh, a franchise now, film franchise, and uh, that was Black Badge. 
and issue number one, first printing on that has skyrocketed to over $100. So there's definitely a lot of interest in that uh, comic company these days. Another one from Marvel, Marauders. It's number 10. Now this book also has been doing really well. This is actually a second printing of the first issue of Mercy. This is issue number two. That's actually cover B. This here is cover A. I apologize, I had them out of order. And cover C. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers still being published. This is the Go Go Power Rangers, issue number 31. That's cover A and cover B. Outer Darkness is doing a crossover with Chu. This is issue number two. Cover A and B. You don't see very many crossovers these days, so it's kind of neat that uh, image is playing around that way. This is a new series by Oni Press, Rogue Planet. Cover A and cover B. This is uh, written by Cullen Bunn, who's been doing some great horror stuff. So, again, another great one to check out. Sarah and the Royal Stars by Vault Comics. This is issue number seven. So, they've been also adapting the Sherlock uh, Holmes uh, by uh, Stephen Moffat. And this one is. Uh, the newest series, issue number five, cover A, B, and C. And this series has actually been done in a uh, kind of Japanese manga style by Titan Comics. Another big Marvel book, Amazing Spider-Man, number 43. And then we do have variant cover for that one as well. Star Wars has relaunched Dr. Afro with a brand new number one. And a variant cover for that one as well. Terry Moore of Strangers in Paradise has been putting out his comic book series five years. And this is the newest issue. It's going to be wrapping up that universe there. Now, Dynamite Press is the king of variant covers. And so, the Vengeance of Vampirilla series, this is issue 7, has quite a few different variant covers. Let's run through those very quickly here. Then V Card by Antarctic Press. This is the last issue in that miniseries. An homage cover to uh, New Mutants. Venom is hitting the big number 25 for their current series with Donny Cates. It's an oversized book. And then variant covers for that one as well. Unfortunately, some of these were damaged, but uh, we'll put a order in with diamond to hopefully get these replaced as quickly as possible. And that brings me to the concept that I definitely do like the way that Lunar Distribution publishes or ships their products better than diamond. So hopefully we'll see them kind of shore some stuff up a little bit and get some better shipping going on. So those are all the books here not including the DC comic books that are going to be available this week. So make sure you visit our digital purchasing platform, our website, and uh, our Facebook page, which I will link down below in the comments. And uh, if you want to leave us a comment, you will be entered in to win a free $10 gift card. 
and we'll be making the announcement as to who won that on our next uh, unboxing that we do. So look for that at the end of the week. And the comment that we want you to leave this week is, we've got a theme going on here for my props this week. There's one of them that is different and from a different franchise. Tell me which one is the oddball item. All right, thanks once again. We're sheltering at home. Thanks to my family and all my uh, uh, animals for behaving. And uh, we'll talk to you soon.